Uh, had 12 hours or so, mate, you had a chance to dissect what happened last night? Ah, uh, yeah, there's, I suppose, still a bit of, um, you know, unknown or just trying to trying to digest the whole situation. But, you know, in saying that, it's it's done now. We've got to try and move on and um, take it as it is. Just extremely proud of how the guys just kept backing up through that game. You know, it was a great arm wrestle and a great ad advertisement for uh, Test Match Rugby. So... For, uh, for, the, for the lads to really stay in the fight and um, come back from that deficit, from a couple of men in the bin, uh, to come back and you know, have a chance to, to win it at the end uh, was, was pretty incredible. Uh, talk us through that, that last play the, with the referee, what were your understandings of what was happening there with, uh, with the referee when you had the penalty? <laughs> yeah, well, there's a bit of confusion just in terms of personnel. Um, on the field for us, so just trying to get a call. It was pretty loud in the in the stadium there last night with 55,000 people. Um, and my conversation was with him that he told me to hurry up, but the time was off. Um, so he, he didn't really mention that there was going to be any further action uh, than starting the clock. Um, for you personally, back back in the team there, uh, first time back in a long time. How does it feel for you wearing the gold jersey in the Test match? Yeah, I really loved it. You know, I uh, I took a uh, a bit of time during the week just to reflect and uh, and to savour the moment. And you know, to be out back out there and in that contest um, in the Test match arena was was something that I really uh, enjoyed and, and tried to you know really cherish the, that opportunity. And um, you know, the game was it was great in terms of how it's exactly what Test match rugby should be like. Um, it ebbed and flowed. There's mistakes, probably unforced errors from from both teams, but. The ability to stay on task, to score some great tries, and um, you know to give yourself a chance, uh, even after everything had happened, um, was incredible. Next week, uh, a trip to Auckland, uh, another tough task. Is it something the team will be up for? Yeah, I suppose we we definitely there's a lot to play for still. You know, it's probably a bit disappointing and, and a bit bittersweet that we're not playing for for trophies and championships. But um, you know, to to go over there. To, to win at Eden Park is, is a massive carrot for us, this team. Uh, and just to build on what we laid down yesterday uh, is, is something that's going to be really important for this squad. And, um, you know, the guys will recover, take a couple of days to get the bodies right, and then we'll uh, to rip into the preparation.